just testing the new settings I've had to move the base unit to a better location but when you do the rewiring everything just goes to pot so I'm just going to push this pawn here just test to see whether microphones working all the settings seems to be the same that's fine okay let's take this pawn and let's support the knight This is a 15 minute, 10 second game. Not really focused on the game, just wanting to um, test the sound and etc. But I might as well do that while I'm playing a game. So they're looking to double the pawns. We're okay with that. Stops the knight from jumping here if they do take with the pawn. Oh, they're not doing that. So they're giving us a two on one here. Our king is a little bit airy, so can expect the queen to come here to lean on the knight. So I'm still going to take. Because we can bring our queen here. We have potential for castling queenside if we have to. So the queen will come here to attack the bishop. They're not doing that, so we, well, could be a tricky situation. Going to bring the bishop here, see if we get tempo. They're going to attack the bishop. Are we going to have time to come there? Because the rook's going to come here, then he's going to put a two on one with the queen on the bishop. So it doesn't look like we're going to get away with castling there. Could do a distraction thing and just take the knight off the board. Do they take with the queen or they take with the queen, which gives us time to actually castle. So only plus one after this, but they're going to go greedy munching for this pawn here to equalize the situation. Can't move the queen because the rook is on the bishop. So we have to move the bishop to a safe place first before we do that. So just going to bring the bishop offline before we even entertain thinking about going for their queen. Queen goes back, we could attack their queen, it's hitting the rook behind it. So I think we may potentially get a back rank, but they might do something a bit maverick. So we're going to hit the queen. Queen takes, we take, his rook takes, the rook takes. So it's even-ish, because then the bishop moves out of the way, so we don't get the back rank. That's fair enough. Oh, they've not done that. They've gone for the queen protecting on this side over here. They could have actually just gone simple. Has their queen landed on anything? I think we'll take. We can lean on the queen. Let's just bring the queen here and obviously they know that's what we're going to do. So they'll be wanting to get their rook out. Oh, they're not doing that just yet. So we'll hit the queen with the rook. So they either have to take the rook or move the queen and probably to here to protect that square. Got a dark square bishop, it's just that it can't really trouble the queen. Could try and do a double, but it gives them time to get the bishop out and support it three times with the rook, with the queen. I'm not sure why they're deliberating because that's where they went to last time. <laughs> They've left the game, but really, they don't need to leave the game. They should realise they can come and protect, unless I am missing something, but I don't think I am. Well, we'll claim victory they did leave, but let's play in the game. Testing the webcam now, so the microphone's okay, lighting's okay. We'll just see if the webcam's working all right. Because I've just moved the base unit about. 
It's so weird how unplugging something can just change the whole world. Let's block this pawn. This is a five minute, five second game. It's just a short thing. I'm just testing stuff out. Let's open up the dark square bishop. Shall we attack the dark square bishop? Yep, let's attack the dark square bishop. Take. Shall we just mobilize the knight? Hello. Castle. My pieces feel like they're jammed in on the other side of the board and our king is home alone. So it looks like they're trying to take advantage of that by having a little bit of a situation here. And we could push the knight across attacking the pawn. I think we'll do that. It's just blocking their way at the minute. Try to get things active, maybe get the overnight up. So it's defending the oops, excuse me, defending. I'm actually going to hit the knight, see what it's actually wanting to do. This pawn is protected. So now they're having to shuffle back. Mm, it's got two pieces there. One takes, one takes, one takes, one takes. Might be onto a winner there. But I think he's probably just going to push on to the knight. Well, okay, if they push on to the knight, we push on to theirs. Forking. Just be a massive take fest. So position of the table isn't right. I have to push it back, but I'm not pushing it back until all the settings are right. So yeah, massive take first. Let's just take, take. They probably think, yeah, okay, let's go with that. And that might be it, mate. Let's bring the queen here, attacking the pawn. Obviously, he's going to come down with this pawn. Let's bring the queen in. Just a second, it's nearly finished. So, they're going greedy munching for pawns, so we'll let them get the pawn here. We're looking to congregate around here at some point. Not necessarily on that diagonal. Not yet. Oh, they've not gone for the pawn. So we're going to go get the rook. And they've left, resigned. Excellent, nice one.